friends, it's me. Merry Christmas, happy holidays. What a wonderful day to check out some fails. Hey, there's someone tree on fire. Someone's tree on fire and someone's just standing there recording. Y'all ain't gonna do anything. Y'all just gonna stand there and record? How does this even happen? How does the tree set a flame? Accidentally watered it with gasoline? Yikes. Oh man, on the back of their car. All I want for Christmas is a divorce. Well, heck. Say less. Drive around, let everybody know. Big yikes. <laughs> oh my god, Ashley, you're such a crackhead. <laughs> Ashley, no, you better come back. <laughs> That's what you get for trying to sit in Santa's seat. <laughs> the dogs woke up early on Christmas morning and absolutely destroyed the entire house. Also, all the presents weren't for us. Oopsies. They really gonna sit there and act like they're the goodest boys. My favorite tradition every Christmas, wrapping gifts as something not even remotely close. So we have like a cocktail shaker and a book. And they wrapped it up to look like a dang gummy bear. <laughs> I go, this is genius. They'll never suspect a thing. I don't know if this is like cute or terrifying. The hold on the bubbles are immaculate. The way they just like wiggle jiggle his head. Would this happen to be a Whovillian civilian? This has got to be the most beautiful, luscious tree I have ever seen. And they did like this video, putting all the lights on it. They spent hours on this, making everything perfect. Almost done. And then in the middle of the night, the entire tree just, ooh, ooh imagine the sound that would have made. I would have thought somebody drove like a truck into my house. So they had to lift it back up. That tree is too big and all of the lights fell off. Annoyed is an understatement. When grandma gives you an envelope and you're just so excited to rip it open. It was money! They just done ripped it open! It's okay, just pop some tape onto that bad boy. <laughs> so they wanted to surprise the kids with daddy dressed up as Santa. And so he... <clears throat> you're supposed to fall from the chimney. Fell from the roof with a big fat oof. That's one too many eggnogs, sir. So they made Santa out of cupcakes. Expectation versus reality. <laughs> <laughs> Reality is often disappointing. <laughs> I was like, eh, close enough. That's the best I could do. 2020 energy right here. <laughs> the best way to clean snow off your car? Shuffle? Nah. Kid, that's the one. Make sure the extra bundled up and wha-bam. Nature's shovel. I'm not gonna lie, even as an adult, I would enjoy this. <laughs> I wanna be festive, but like, my hair. So I did this. This guy did this. Told his barber, I want a Christmas tree the back of my head. Leave enough hair so I can attach the smallest little bow. They call him tree head. Very festive. At this elementary school, on Saturday, December 14th, we got breakfast with Satan. Huh? They meant to spell Santa. Or did they? Breakfast with Santa, but Santa is so close to Satan. Just move a couple letters around, they're both red. Coincidence? I think not. I've never had a real tree before, and growing up, I always wanted one. But look, they're like, our tree is broken. The pines just fell off. It was cut seven days ago. Ooh, a perfect representation of a 2020 Christmas. A mess. I think you're supposed to water them. That tree was dead before y'all brought it home. I don't know, maybe the stress of being cut down made it lose all its hair. <laughs> what I imagined. <gasps> Whoa, that's nice. Real nice. Pretty. What I got? Okay, at least you got like blow up stuff. Half those lights don't even come on. You wanna see what I got? I'll show you what I got. These are my lights. Because I decided to do myself. Yes, that well is all I got. My lights are the saddest on the block. This ungrateful child wrote a letter to Santa. It was like, dear Santa, I am writing this the day after Christmas and I am very sad. I only received one of the two presents I asked for. Since you ate my cookies, I will assume that my missing gift was a miss. Take. I will give you one week to fix this. Jeremy. Sounds like Karen's letter to the manager. <laughs> Here to complain about my Christmas gifts. And so Santa, the parents, wrote back, Dear Jeremy, I'm sorry you're disappointed with your presents. You asked for two very expensive presents and Santa can only do so much. You need to learn to be grateful for what you have, not upset about what you don't. If you continue to complain, I will have no choice but to add you to the naughty list next year. Ooh. But instead of just being a good boy, Jeremy had to take it a step further. Dear fatty, your threats don't scare me. I played your game and you did not deliver. This is not okay. I will give you one week and then you will pay, Jeremy. P.S. I don't know why you care that it is expensive when you have elf slaves to make things for you. <laughs> I think you are naughty for having slaves. <laughs> 
Got him! Jeremy ain't going down without a fight. You gonna give me my PS5? Or else. Dear Jeremy, you're being a very bad little boy. Because you cannot be happy with what you have. I have talked to your parents and told them to take away your Wii U. <laughs> now you have nothing. Once you learn to be grateful, perhaps you can have it back. I'm very disappointed in you, Jeremy. You'll have to be an extra good boy this year if you want to get back on the nice list. And just like that, Jeremy was sent to the gulag. If this doesn't perfectly sum up 2020, I don't know what does. Oof. I thought it was gonna fall on him, but how does that happen? Half the bottom branch is just like, yeet. I'm alive, but I'm dead. I was not aware there were so many issues with real trees. <laughs> this was just very unfortunate gift wrap placement. The way they folded it. She just covered her eyes, she don't know what's going on. And it, <laughs> rated R wrapping paper. So I saw this on TikTok. I think this would be a really fun holiday thing to do with like your friends or your family. So they're like holding them back and hanging up some snacks. And you run full speed ahead to snatch a snack. How I make hot chocolate. Mine, lots of marshmallows. You know, put extra love into it. Ooh, peppermint sprinkles versus Kenzie's. That's how I do for my siblings. <laughs> hey, at least you put all the toppings on it. I would have just like, bam, hot cocoa. You want a marshmallow? I can spare a marshmallow. Here you go. Made with hate. So you know those mugs, when you pour hot liquid into them, they change colors? Like this is the before and this is the after. But they ordered and then got this. What is this? <laughs> changing mug. This gotta be from wish.com. Destroying wishes since 2003. I don't know how long they've been around. Heinz Ketchup was like, hey, you need a gift idea? <laughs> Give them their favorite condiment this year. Ketchup. The gift that can do no wrong. The gift of glizzy topping. This is what a palm tree looks like before life. And then after life. Sir, that's legal. At Walmart, they were selling gasoline. And they were like, light up Christmas. Whose house y'all trying to burn down? The only thing you lighting up is some arson. They know exactly what they were doing. So Reese's made a peanut butter tree. And then they open it up. That ain't a tree. That's a log. Nah, I kind of look like a big fat doo-doo. <laughs> this is false advertising. My Christmas is ruined. Cause y'all prepackaged me a boneless tree. Unbelievable. What is that, iPhone 4? Yeah, I'd be crying if I got one of those too. <laughs> I'm kidding, not really. This picture is old. But basically, she didn't get the color she wanted. It started crying. Hard life, my guy. Elf on a shelf? No. In 2020, Elf floating around himself. They attached him to a fan and made him go skirt. <laughs> I don't know what mall had this set up. And it was like, Christmas tree. <laughs> no, it's a Christmas dookie. Santa's reindeer dropping more than presents this year. Just a big fat merry turd. Oh. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below, let me know what you're doing today. I hope you guys have a really great day today. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and the face. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click, and subscribe to the Wolf Pack. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.